Hello YouTube and welcome to my uh, first C++ tutorial. Um, this tutorial will be about uh, some, what you may call like a, I don't know, like a simple calculator program I guess. Um, what it's going to do is, it's just kind of like a calculator where you input a fir the first number, then you um, put in the operation for this since it's simple. It'll only be uh, plus, minus, uh, multiply by or divided by sign and um, okay so let's start okay so first off since like I said it's kind of a simple one we're only going to need IO stream uh, and we're going to be using namespace std and the main function int main okay so to start off I like to uh, state the variables so the integer the first number which will hold the which is the variable that will hold the first number that the player inputs I mean user uh, same thing for the second number but with the second number the input and the character operation since it will be a uh, character like plus minus uh, the star sign and uh, divided by um, and this right here I'll explain to you why I uh, added that later okay so next we're going to kind of welcome the user uh, it's kind of like a header thing I put in here uh, it's just something I like to put on the top to make it look cool um, so it'll say C out it'll see out um, welcome to my simple calculator uh, and I'll put the lines underneath just so it looks kind of cool and then I'll uh, make a space between the next line of code uh, down there um, and sorry I'm getting used to this cam studio crap but um, so this is the uh, next part where we ask them to input the first number uh, so I just said please input the first number you could really say anything you want uh, end line then uh, C in the first number so the variable first number now has whatever the user types in inside of it um, then you can ask for the operation like I said it's a simple one so it's just going to have the plus minus multiplied by and divided by sign uh, another end line and uh, another CN for the operation variable uh, then we're going to ask the user for the second number uh, Another end line and sin for the CN for the second number. This is the most confusing part of this program and it's really easy. So uh, it is, as I stated, very simple. It's just an if statement. So it's saying if uh, whatever the user uh, typed in for the operation equals the character plus, it'll. Um, print out, uh, let's say the user put in for the first number 5, they'll print out 5 space plus space, uh, second number let's say it's 7, and uh, that will equal, uh, equal, it will equal um, whatever the thing is, in this case it would be uh, 11, I mean 12. Ah. <laughs> Um, and, uh, I added spaces between the, uh, on both sides of the, uh, operation and the equal sign, because if you don't, it's kind of harder to read, and, uh, programmers usually use clarification, so it's better. Uh, now here's the actual expression part of, uh, the, this, uh, program. It's, um, the first number plus the second number, uh, and then end line because it'll just say it'll say um, the first number then the operation second number equals the first number plus the second number okay so for the other operations I just did the same exact thing just change the plus sign or the um, minus sign or whatever for um, other operation signs so I did plus first, so I just changed the plus to a minus. Same for the multiplication and division. 
Uh, then I uh, did a system pause so that after this um, program goes or that part goes through the operation part, it uh, will pause so that you can see what the number is and write it down or whatever you have to do with it. Uh, and it doesn't just disappear immediately. And then I did system clear screen and I'll explain that in a moment. Okay, so now I'll explain, I'll explain why I did the go on equals 5. Um, cause it's because I did a, a do while uh, loop because uh, I wanted to keep coming uh, back after you uh, did one operation so that it wouldn't just close after you did it once. Um, so the int go on equals 5, so I did do everything uh, in this code that I just showed you uh, and while the operation and while the uh, variable go on equals 5 and that's why I did the system clear screen so that it doesn't just have a bunch of uh, um, like it doesn't have this program over and over again right next to each other it just kind of clears the screen makes it a little clearer for clarification like I said programmers really need that or else uh, programs are hard to read. It's just confusing. Okay, so now that I've explained my program to you, uh, let's try it out. Hopefully I don't get any errors. Uh, okay, so here it is for the most part. I don't know if you can see it all with this. Uh, thing. Okay, so please input the first number. Uh, I'll just do 5 uh, plus or, yeah, that's plus 6. 5 plus 6 is 11. So that's the pause part, the pressing a key to continue. And then it clears the screen, which I really like. Um, so now it's just all the operations. So I already did the plus 1. 6 uh, minus 7. Negative 1. 9 times 4. 36 and finally division 9 divided by 3 and divided by 3 equals 3 like I said this is very simple uh, I have found like one one bug which is uh, sometimes when you do the divided sign since I didn't make the uh, numbers floats since uh, because of that like if I do 9 divided by I don't know, let's say uh, 5. It's just going to say 1 because it's going to be, um, uh, it's going the number is going to have a decimal, so it's going to either round up or down to the closest whole number. So, I don't know what that would be, 9 divided by 5, you guys can do the math, but if you round it off, it'll equal 1. So that's just kind of a bug, like if you're, if you need the decimal for whatever you're doing, then you might not want to do this. I don't know. It's really up to you guys. You guys are the consumers, as you may say. Um, thank you for watching, I guess. This is kind of my first video. Uh, please tell me if there's anything like I could do to improve these. I'm guessing there's tons. Um, uh, hopefully I make more of these, just in general. I don't know if I'm going to be able to with school and all that. But um, just uh, ask me if you like these and i'll make more and uh thank you youtube thank you whoever's watching and uh bye